Hello people, I'm Vito and welcome back to Fire Emblem Radiant Dawn with Robberlink. Hello. Alright, where we last left off, we made some good progress on this mission. We got rid of the bolting dude. We had to redo a turn because they kind of put us in a bad position. But now we only have Gatry and Ike here between all the wyvern riders and such, and they should be able to handle themselves. Meanwhile, hopefully... Uh, we can do a bit of sneaky, sneaky thieving. So, I think last turn, the guy with the storm sword may have gotten himself killed. Yeah, but... Oh, well. So, there's still that, and then possibly the elixir, if you can still manage to get that from Istvan. Maybe have, I don't know, if you can make it so that Ike doesn't move too far away from where Heather's going to be, but not too close that Istvan will go after Heather until we're ready. The issue is, was your move seven? And he can go nine. Ten if you include him having a short axe. Or, you know, that'd be eleven, wouldn't it? Hmm. So then the solution might be to have Ike move left... And then once you're ready and you've cleared out the rest of those guys, have Ike and Heather move towards each other. And then Istvan will hopefully only be able to get to Ike, but then we'll move into range of Heather. But that's that's for when we've cleared out everyone else. Yeah, I think I get it. And there's a lot of these people who are kind of far behind. Oh, yeah, that'll help. Thank get you. going. <laughs> Get a move on, scrub. Get more crits. It's like you're one to talk. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, actually telling Mia to get more crits. <laughs> uh, does anyone need healing? No. I don't require healing. <laughs> My apologies. <laughs> All the healers just looking at Genji like, Who are you? <laughs> what have you done with Genji? Eh. Maybe I'll have someone Kanto back here. We'll see. Uh, right, you don't have anything. Which means you are permitted to die. Immediately. We have no need for you. Goodbye. Now, Soren, what have we learned? A little. <laughs> you learned to be a bit beefier <laughs> and how to get lucky. Somehow. I don't know how you learned that from killing someone, but, you know, whatever works. Okay, this guy... Actually, yeah, I don't really have to worry about you guys, because you don't have any of your own weapons. You don't have lights or anything. So, uh... Just take on the generals? Basically. Okay. Yeah, Har could probably already attack as long as he can Kanto out. Which I imagine he can. Yeah. And uh, if you don't mind getting hit hard so that uh, <laughs> Mist can have something to do. Look, wait, are you sure? I thought the point was not to get hurt. Alright then. <laughs> Alright, thanks. Way to be a team player, Har. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> Boyd, why do you ruin everything? <laughs> <laughs> eh. I'll just wait here, then. Hmm. Shut it. <laughs> I know what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. 
<laughs> no, that won't be enough. Because he's all the way down here. Alright. Just move them all up. I was thinking maybe if he just wanted to move left and let him get himself killed. Unless he would have retreated, I don't know. Well, he has a hammer. I don't want him going after Gatry. Man, I think we wanted Gatry to leave the javelin equipped so that... Oh yeah, so that he get a little bit less aggro. Yeah. And then we'll just have Gatry go left towards those guys then, probably? Yeah, that was right. Thank you for reminding me. I was going to put him in the bush. <laughs> I don't think that would hide him very well. <laughs> no, but that extra avoidance helps. I was just thinking of the image of it. It's like, oh. <laughs> I'm in this bush. They can't see me now. Giant blue armor. <laughs> Sticking out of the bush. Completely incons inconspicuous. Exactly. Uh, yeah, just stand there. <laughs> I thought he still had 4% chance before. <laughs> I I'm going to assume it's bio rhythm. <laughs> That's just my go-to. If there's something I can't explain, Fire Emblem. It's probably bio rhythm. <laughs> it, it could in fact be. It's bio rhythm. I don't have to explain crap. <laughs> okay, yeah, you, you need to be careful because Istvan, uh... He's can't, moved closer. Yeah, using Kanto. Which means we need to bait him a little bit harder. So that he doesn't have that much movement to go back. Mm-hmm. Very good. <laughs> ha, you suck. So much that I'm going to poke you again. Or not. <laughs> <laughs> well, now this is awkward. <laughs> it's fine. He'll live. To poke yet again. At some point, we should just put Elvira music whenever <laughs> we have, like, a wyvern or pegasus fighting a general. And just as the general slowly walks. All right. Did he use part of that staff that he's going to drop? That, like, really good staff? Probably. Okay. Nope, nope this, this guy has mend. Okay, good. I was going to say, he's like... How dare you weaken the usage on that item we're going to get from you? <laughs> How dare you use my property? <laughs> I'm the one holding it for now. <laughs> yeah, if you can kill the general, then you should be able to put Heather there to steal safely, right? Yeah. Uh. Okay, do this. Do, 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 That's Jeopardy music, not elevator music. Or, I don't know, would it still qualify as the same type of music? It, it has the same energy. <laughs> I think. Arguably, I wouldn't know. <laughs> Me neither. I don't study genres and what genre elevator music is, you know, like what it's considered to be like. We only know, you know, general energy, feel of it. Yeah. Whatever. The vibes. <laughs> it 
it is nice to see 0% hit chance against someone that isn't Ike. Because with Ike, you know, that's to be expected. He's just so good. But against Oscar, that's pretty nice. Indeed. Can one of you fling something a little harder? <laughs> hmm. No. <laughs> Dang. Yes, this will work. No. Well, I, I guess I don't need Titania to carry Heather. I guess... Yeah, Boyd could pick her up. Would you Actually, even need to? No, no, I guess not. I don't know why I didn't consider that. Like, what about the other general? Yeah, no, you're good. That's what I was saying earlier, was that you can just take his spot with Heather and you'll be fine. Yeah, but I assumed I'd have to get him back, or her back out. Whatever, I was wrong. <laughs> let's just move on. Uh, you know what, let's get you some XP. Like, darn it, I didn't kill him. It's like, that's okay, Rolf. We just wanted you to get the experience of hurting him. But I crave blood. <laughs> ah, it's my little psychopath. <laughs> Wait. Okay, that was. <laughs> I was gonna say she missed at ninety-two percent chance. I was about to be like, Titania, do we need to have a talk? But no. Quite lucky. Also lucky that he did exactly twelve damage, which I believe is then halved with counter. Yep. Perfect. Yoink. Yeah, just pick one. Doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah. I was going to say, how did Soren get hurt? But he got HP maxed up. Yep. With his level up. Right? Hurt them. Mm. Hurt them good. Yeah. Eh, might as well. Make use of this. Almost. Darn. Darn you enemies, stop frickin' avoiding. Alright, then, yeah, I'd put him close to the edge of his reach, maybe, to get him away from the general. And then... Well, I mean, you don't need to leave that guy alive, yeah. so... Okay, you can't reach. You can't. Actually, wait. Level 9, level 10. Okay, yeah. This should work nicely as long as you don't miss. Come on, don't don't be like a missing streak or anything. There we go, good. Please, if she missed, it would have just been so that someone else could get the XP. I guess that's fair. Uh, hey, I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that, and you know what? Just keep doing that. It's like, ha! Huh, now I have a chance of hitting you. Now that you've left the bushes, <laughs> not a great chance, but I'll take anything I can get. And this guy's just dead. Yeah, dang, the, uh, the weapon advantage triangle actually gave him some chance to hit. Not that it worked out for him. Oh no. He might do three damage. No. <laughs> <laughs> Just that log pause. Yeah, what was that about? 
That seemed unusual. Like, I get it was the game just loading, but it's it still funny. It, like, they have just, like, stare. I'm like, yeah, no. Not today. <laughs> there, I got it this time. I learned how to do it. And you know what I also learned? How to do it with more power. Wait, wait where are you going? <laughs> Get back here. Where's he gonna go? He doesn't have anyone to heal him unless he's allowed to escape. <laughs> Jeez. Gatcher, you can just flag it. <laughs> uh, there we go. Half the episode. It's just generals walking towards wyverns. <laughs> that makes me think of something I saw as like a, a meme post on Discord. Uh, it's like a wiki part of Wikipedia that says there's something called like some movie of painting dry or no wait, paint drawing on a wall. Sorry if I could speak. Um, and it was made specifically to make like the the British movie rating organization sit through ten hours to rate it. <laughs> wow. So it's just like a big troll apparently. <laughs> That's so mean. <laughs> I assume they must have done something to deserve it if someone went out of their way to do that. Uh Critics say it's the blockbuster of the year. Ooh. Watching paint on a wall dry. Yes. <laughs> Alright. Actually, you don't have anything, do you? Yeah, I don't need a steal. I can just kill. Um, while they're near each other, do you want to give Mist to the Reaper card? I guess. Still, I still think you're kind of overestimating its value, but... Hmm. I'm hoping it'll be worthwhile on her. Oscar, do a stab. I... What do you think you're doing? You're gonna break it. Stop bonking my horse. <laughs> it's a freaking valuable staff. And it's mine now. Yeah, did that actually expend a usage? I don't think so. Oh. No, okay. Okay, I thought it did. I was wrong, thankfully. It kind of would make sense if it did, though, now that I think about it. Huh. I guess... It's, you know, usage is the magic within it, not the physical yeah. durability. Wait, what do you have? Axe. Wait a minute, it's Nephany. Why does she care about a weapon triangle? <laughs> Get back here. <laughs> Get back here as he runs menacingly towards him while chugging a vulnerary. <laughs> hey, you know what's going to happen to you? Hello. What's about to happen to this guy? Allow me to demonstrate. It goes a little something like this. And then this. And finally, this. I was hoping he'd crit. <laughs> Just show off. Uh. All right. <gasps> Missed. You're hurt. Let me get that for you. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. I was thinking now, if you want, because we want Heather to be in a position where she can get to... Istvan at some point to steal the elixir. Do you want to have Har and... Unless you're going to do that. Well, what was your idea? Um, I guess you could have someone else do the pickup. You could have someone pick up Heather, then have Titania take and then drop further down if you can, maybe. 
I don't know. Would you need two people with Kanto to make that work, though? I mean, I think it'd be easier just to have Heather move. Okay. Personally. Whatever works. We're hunting now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, you're not the guy with the... With the what? With the ranged weapon. Didn't you give him a javelin? <laughs> We're still hunting now. <laughs> And the rest of you, uh... Is sit tight, I guess? I mean, yeah, you could shove Heather a bit. Although you've probably... Why did I put Titania <laughs> yeah, there? I was, I was thinking that. I was like, huh. Okay, Shinon. Keep the shove train going. Hey, if it works. Hmm. That chance is getting higher and higher because of the biorhythm, probably. <laughs> Only eight damage? Hmm. Yeah, it's not as much as I would have hoped. I guess that's one stat that's starting to lack a little bit. Is mm. her damage. May need to work on that. Oh yeah, I forgot that they actually uh fight in the air if they're both air units. Alright, what do we got? Strength and defense, just like Gatry. All right, seeing a pattern here. <laughs> I shouldn't need this, but just in case. Yeah. So then deal with him. Hmm. The blade? Yes. Hmm, if he lives. Missed? Could she reach? Use oh, by the way, uh, did the last episode go up yet? Or the one before that? Probably not, no. Hmm. Because I was just wondering if you saw the, uh... Oh, the hop? Yeah. Yeah, I saw it. <laughs> okay. In, in editing. So yeah, can you get missed close enough to attack? Uh, I don't know if enough shoves would work. I mean, probably, but... Uh, you don't have to. <laughs> what, first... Let's do this. Get you out of the way and heal. And train. <laughs> oh, hey, look! Someone shovelable. Here you go. <laughs> Uh. Is that enough? Yes, it is. Oh, well, that works too. Don't even need to waste the uh, the Reaper card. Actually, how much would it? Wait, what? Does it have to be non-magic users launch them? Well, you're not using magic, technically. Or does it just consider the staff to be... I'm assuming this... Well, the staffs use magic, so... <sighs> I told you you were overestimating their usefulness. Me, I'm mad. <sighs> but she doesn't use, like, magic attacks, though, so it should still frickin' work. Uh <laughs> I'm allergic to my plans not working. <sighs> Alright, well at least we should be able to finish this off. Yep. <sighs> and finally be done with the level. Yep. And that is everyone dead. 
except the commander. Right? Yep. Alright, so I'd move Gatry out of range and then, yeah, put Ike as far to the right within his range as possible. Hmm. Well, you want to go towards right, head up there. So, yeah. And how close can Heather get? Yeah, I can give you one shove. It's just I don't know how... Okay, she can actually move pretty well through the bog, so yeah, that should be fine then. And then you guys... In case Ike can't one-shot him, or if I want someone else to get the kill, just sit here for the... Uh, well, I guess it is an ambush. <laughs> yeah, worst worst possibility you can just rescue Heather with Ike. Ike might get hit, but he can take it. Darn. It finally worked. You jerk. All right. Can she escape his range just in case, or can she reach? Although, yeah, there's there's only like one position next to him now. Yeah. A little annoying, but whatever. That's a nice elixir you got there. It's mine now. <laughs> what? <laughs> How could this happen? Uh. You know, you're being a little inconvenient right now, is fun. <laughs> okay, you'd live if he attacked you. You could equip him with something that isn't weak to him. Yeah, but he's, this guy's using a short axe. Mm. Oh, wait, no. Kind of forgot an important step there. <laughs> Are along. <laughs> Teleportation. <laughs> well, I guess it's more transportation. The lightning people waiting right out of range. If he dares approach. Yep. Probably just because Oscar is there. I don't know. Yeah, but it's funny because <laughs> he can get there, but he can't hit there. Right, the trap is laid. He has nothing to do but die. So make your choice. Don't you dare just stay there hiding in the mountains. Yeah, that that would be smart of him. You son of a... <laughs> All right, well, it is about time to end the episode, so perhaps we should just finish him off next time. All right. Although, hmm. 
There's gonna be dialogue anyway. Yeah, it's just them. that you know I'd like you to have time off screen to go through the shop and everything. But yeah, oh well. So yes, we will have to end this here for now, and we will continue this next time. So goodbye, dear viewers, for now. Goodbye.